everyone. So this video is kind of a tackle. I don't know why I did that with my hand. Sorry, hang on one sec. I, this thing's poking out my door and it's really annoying. Okay, <laughs> this is kind of a tackle, but also it's not really because I only have two things and three things kind of, but I showed you one already. Um, so yeah, first of all, excuse my face. I got so sunburnt yesterday and you're probably like, oh, it's not that bad. I've got like foundation on to cover it up and it still looks pretty bad so imagine what it's like without it's like the color of that anyway, it hurts it hurts we had swimming sports I didn't put very much sunscreen on I was an idiot um, and it hurts and please be sun smart I wasn't but please do and I'll teach myself in the future to be more sun smart also if this scarf here is yours please let me know I'm pretty sure I know who it is but it's been at my house in my, since my birthday, so um, if it's yours and you're watching this, just let me know. And obviously, if you comment below and I've never met you before, I will know you're lying. So don't lie to me. Um, anyway, so yeah, just going to show you a couple of things. Um, I haven't made videos um, all week. My last video was a vlog, a St Kilda Fest vlog. Um, and I wasn't planning to make that video, but I just did because I love you guys. Um, but yeah, so um, I will be making some more videos hopefully today and tomorrow. It just depends. I'm going to make this quick because my um, grandpa is here and he's going away again. So thanks um, for coming, Pa. Lucky you'll be watching this. I don't know if you are, but sometimes you watch my videos. Um, uh, so... Yeah, also excuse my hair, it was pouring down rain this morning, I went for a really long walk in the rain, I got soaked, like, it was literally like I jumped in the pool with clothes on, um, but it was nice, it was lovely, um, but my shoes are really wet and disgusting, but anyway, so let's just show you the things, I told you in my last video that I was going to show you some things that once I got here, and they did, so I went to Horse Gear Outlet, I know I'm not meant to be buying things, I'm meant to be saving for a float, save for a float, Kate. But I just, internet shopping is really a big problem for me because I buy a lot of stuff that um, I probably wouldn't buy if I had to go to a shop to get it because I would have a bit more self, self um, control. But no, it's so easy to buy online and there's so much temptation and I always see things. I'm like, please, please, please. But anyway, so Horsky Outlet released these saddle pads. Um, a couple of months ago, and at the time, I was like, yes, I have to get those, I have to get those, but I was like, no, you're not meant to be buying more things, and then I was like, come on, come on, just buy it, just buy it, but, okay, so these are two saddle pads, as you probably realise by now, um, and they are, they were only 15, well, $14.95 each, which is a really good deal for saddle pads, especially if you're in Australia, because it's pretty impossible to find a saddle pad under $30. And $30 is a pretty, like, oh my gosh, that is pretty cheap um, saddle pad in Australia. So when I saw these, I was like, they look so nice, they're so cheap. Um, and I have quite a few colours as well, like not a million colours, but quite a few. Um, so anyway, I'll just show you. Um, the first one is this grey one. I don't know how zoomed in my camera is, how the frame is, but it's got this logo here that says um, Showmaster um, 1967. I don't know. Um, anyway, so I got this grey one and they just have the normal billet straps um, and girth loops and it's pretty like pretty thick. It's pr it's pretty nice and thick and nice. Um, it's not huge, like not overly thick though. Um, it's just a really nice one. And this one's like just normal cotton on the inside. It's a really nice charcoal color. They had two grays. I went for the darker one just because it'd be easier to clean. But I didn't have any gray saddle pads, so I really wanted to get one because I think it'll go with everything. It always looks professional, like gray. It always looks nice, um, and it'll really so suit the boys. Um, so I got that, and I was like, well, I'm going to have to pay shipping, so I may as well get two, right? And also, I'm so bad at choosing, so I 
had to. Um, I got this brown one as well. This is in the colour chocolate and it's really nice. I've been wanting to get a brown saddle pad for a long time. Even though my saddle's black, I still think it'll look okay. Um, because then I can like match so many things to it and I have brown breeches that I can match. Um, and I think it'll just look really nice. Um, and this one, I it's got the same logo and stuff on it but this one I was really surprised it's got this really nice like waffle um, material on the other side I don't know if you're gonna be able to tell um, it, I don't know what my camera's doing but um, it's the waffle um, knit in black and that's gonna be really nice like it doesn't tell you what's gonna be waffle what's gonna be just plain and it says that some might come with a different border like horse gear outlet you don't you sometimes don't really know what you're getting it's always been good. This is my second time ordering from them and they have extremely cheap things but everything has kind of got like a little like fault kind of thing because it's just an outlet thing. Um, not saying that things aren't going to work um, but they've usually got like some little um, construction. I don't know. There could be something wrong with it but like nothing that stops you using it kind of thing. So maybe like it wasn't meant to have this in the inside who knows but it's really nice it's still it's again really nice and thick padded but not like overly thick and I think this is gonna look so nice and classy like it just looks so nice and for this is like $15 it's pretty much the cheapest saddle pad I've ever got ever bought and it's one of the nicest looking so that is that and the last thing I just wanted to show you I have shown you before in my what I got for my birthday haul but for those of you who don't watch the non-horsey videos um, you might not have seen it and I just it's so pretty um, I'll just show you and it has a lot of dirt on it right now um, Wow, I think that's just from my carpet, I don't know. But it is this um, beautiful blue, baby blue weather beater saddle pad. It's the one with the, all the air thing. This is so thin and so nice. Like, not too thin that it's bad. It's a really nice summer thin. And I did use this, excuse all the hair. I washed it, but the, there's still a lot of hair on it. Um, I've only used this once so far because I have been not riding for... I'm not riding the boys for a bit just because I've been super busy and um, yeah mostly just busy and weather has been pretty hot in the last week um, but yeah this I really like I definitely recommend it um, it's so summery it's the only thing is because it's a light color it gets a little stain I got a little stain here I don't know how <laughs> but um and I also got some stains here, but once the saddle's on, you can't see any of those. But I really like this as well. So, um, these are my three pretty beautiful new saddle blankets. I have a problem. I can't ever stop thinking about buying saddle pads. I just love them. It's so fun to match your outfits to your horse, and like, like the horses don't care, but. It's so fun. I just love it. I have a problem. But yeah, I also, I've got some videos kind of in mind, but just if I have the time to get them done, um, I have been procrastinating a lot lately, especially, um, of not doing my homework. Um, I have been doing my homework, but it takes a lot of effort to do my homework, so that's a problem, but yeah, I will be trying to do some homework because I have um, a few things to hand in on Monday. It is Saturday so um, I have time. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um, thank you so much for watching. As always I love you guys so much and you guys are the best. Thank you for sticking with me. Um, I know I haven't been posting nearly as much as usual but um, just stick with me. I just need to organize my brain <laughs> and my schedule. I need to get a filming schedule and start filming like certain days so hopefully I can build up to more than once a week but at least I haven't like left you for more than a week so yeah that's good. Okay I love you and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!